I don't know how many grams a dollar of model airplane propellers is in your area, but every time a crash happens, the part I feel most sorry for is the airplane's propeller. Especially for large model airplanes, like 3D printed models that often require 15 or 16 inch propellers, a set of wooden three blade propellers can cost over 40 close to $50. Even a small bump is enough to make me feel heartbroken, let alone a crash. A printed airplane isn't even as expensive as a set of propellers. Moreover, there hasn't been a relatively cheap alternative propeller for a long time. Until last year, when I saw that Philip Sims released several sets of 3D printed propeller designs. With a mindset of giving it a try, we installed a set of 3D printed propellers while making the B-25 episode of our video series. However, the result was that the propeller detached in mid-air, leading to a low altitude single engine failure and a stall crash. Ah, this time it was even more painful. After our investigation, we found that the cause of the accident was the incorrect material used for the propeller. The official manual recommended PLA material, which was clearly not suitable in this case. We also demonstrated through practice that PLA is indeed not suitable for printing propellers. Later, we switched the printing material to PA nylon and used multicolor printing technology, employing specialized support materials when printing the propeller's support base. This not only made the removal of supports easier, but also resulted in a much better support phase compared to conventional support methods. Of course, through our multiple tests, we found that it's not necessarily required to use nylon material for printing. Materials like PETG or ABS can also ensure flight, and even some types of PLA can be suitable for flying. However, it is crucial to ensure that the base of the printed propeller is made with high strength materials because it was only when we were preparing this video that we discovered the fundamental reason for the propeller explosion on the B-25 aircraft was due to the base cracking. You can clearly see that the fixed structure failed along the layer lines. Therefore, we strongly recommend using high strength materials for printing here. Hey, what are the high performance printing materials? The 3D printing technology empowers every user with the ability to create independently, allowing us to produce what we want at a lower cost and with high efficiency. If anyone has questions or curiosities about 3D printing propellers, feel free to leave a comment for discussion. This is the end of all the content for this video. Please don't forget to like, comment and subscribe. Let's meet again in the next episode for more exciting content.